Hi everybody, Pat Patterson here at TheRacingGuide.com. I love short track racing and so far we've had a couple. Bristol, well that was pretty good. Martinsville, that was really good. And now to Richmond, Virginia. I love the Commonwealth and I love that racetrack at the fairgrounds. You can bet it's going to be a show on Saturday night. Nationwide Series cars on Friday night and uh, a tough, tough race again because this is one of those racetracks that's going to be key to making the chase. Remember that the chase cutoff comes late August there when we come back to Richmond. So you need to figure out how this race is going to be for you, what you need to do to come back here if you think you're going to be a chase contender and be ready to uh, close the deal perhaps on the big night that we come back to Richmond the second time around. Okay, so what does it take to go fast at Richmond and to be successful here on Saturday night? Just listen to this. Man, Richmond is about one thing, and that's roll in the center. Uh, you get tight in the middle of one and two, and tight in the middle of three and four. You got to have a car that, that that the left front works the middle of the corner really good, so you can you can gain time there. If you're gonna, that's where you're going to gain time. It's the only place to gain time. You're not going to beat guys into the corner. Or not really going to beat them off the corner if you can't get through the center. So uh, well, that's what we work on. That's what we concentrate on when we're there practicing before the races. Because when I drove for Rusty Wallace in 2008, I was like. I wasn't very good at Richmond, and then he had taught me a few tricks, and I'm not going to really say what they are, but it was more of what you look for in setting your car up and where to pass at, I should say, and that really helped me out huge, and Rusty has had a lot of success here at Richmond, but Richmond's very difficult because we go there and we practice, qualify all on the same day, and then they'll run a nationwide race, and then we race the next day, so tracks in different condition, different you know time of day, and uh, it's very difficult, but um, it's a one-of-a-kind place. They've tried duplicating it, but nothing's able to duplicate. It's, it's a phenomenal place to go and uh, run at. So, racing under the lights at the beautiful Richmond Fairgrounds. Doesn't get any better than that. It's going to be a great show, no doubt about it. As always, we're here because of our friends at Duralube Engine Treatment and their fine family of automotive products. And I want to talk to you about one right now. This is Duralube Severe Fuel System Cleaner. Duralube Severe Fuel System Cleaner is precisely formulated to clean the entire fuel delivery system, including fuel injectors, carburetors, valves, ports, and the intake manifold. One 16 ounce bottle treats up to 42 gallons of fuel. Use it every 3,000 miles. It's compatible with all grades of gasoline fuel, including E10, E15, E85 ethanol blends, and good news, will not harm your catalytic converter. Where do I get it, Pat? Well, you know where you can get it. Get it at Walmart and get it today. Don't forget, you got a question for me, send me a tweet, at Racing Guy, uh, or for Duraloop. Be sure to follow them as well, at Duraloop. Check out both of our websites, and as always, we love hearing from you. Have a great weekend. We're going racing at Richmond.